When Kobo first entered the market, they were competing against established players and recognizable brands based on price. Theirs was the ebook reader you would buy on a budget. But time has passed, and now that they themselves have become an established player, they're starting to compete based on features. This week we take a look at the Aura HD, which they claim has the highest resolution screen of any ebook reader on the market. With a 6.8 inch display, the screen is certainly larger than previous Kobo readers while still retaining a comfortable book size. The 1 GHz processor means that it also runs faster as well. With ebooks, it's not about being visually impressive, it's about trying to match the comfort of the printed page. With a 1440 by 1080 screen resolution, Kobo can now do a more sophisticated job of presenting text to adjust not just font size, but weight and sharpness to adjust line spacing margins and justification too. This also makes it easier to offer a wider range of font styles, and so combined with all these settings, it's easy to fine-tune your reading experience to match your personal comfort level. Most touchscreen devices tend to look the same today, but Kobo has added a really nice sculptured louvre design to the back to help it stand out and be distinctive. Included in the box is a braided USB cable, a really nice touch. Touchscreen controls are fairly responsive and work well enough for typing, highlighting, and looking up definitions. For reading at night, there's the built-in illumination system, which I find works quite well in delivering a lighting source that is uniform from top to bottom, that manages to be very bright without being harsh on the eyes. And if you go into the touchscreen settings, you can actually adjust the level of the brightness to suit the room that you're reading in. Here's where things get a little ugly. When you click on the online bookstore, you're given a set of options that lead to a very long and boring list of categories. This in turn leads to another long and boring list of categories. And when you do find the genre you're looking for, you're going to have to wait. The 1 GHz processor isn't much of an advantage when it comes to connecting online. When the book listings do arrive, you're going to find tiny little book covers and not a lot of detail. Although it's very convenient to purchase books directly through a device, this system doesn't allow for much in the way of browsing or discovering new authors. It's a shame that the online store is such an awkward experience because everything else about this product is great. The sophisticated design combined with uh, the reading options that come with a high resolution screen create an experience that's really comfortable and very satisfying. So far I would say that this is Kobo's finest product.